subtraction. Subtraction gives the difference between two numbers. Thus, the answer in subtraction is called the difference. We subtract the numbers by arranging in vertical columns. Look at the example. 16 minus 7. The difference is 9. This also can be represented like 10 plus 6 minus 7. That is equal to 10 minus 7 is equal to 3 plus 6. Together it is 9. We can check and verify the answer by adding the difference and subtrahend. Look at the example. 4725 minus 1659. First find the difference of the digits of units place. That is 5 minus 9. Here 5 is lesser than 9. So let us borrow 110 from 10's place as we have already learnt. So that we can say 10 plus 5 minus 9. That is equal to 10 minus 9 is equal to 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. Now let us see the digits of 10's place. Since we borrowed 110 to units place, we have only 110 in 10's place. That is 1 minus 5. So let us borrow 100 from 100's place. That is 11 minus 5. 10 plus 1 minus 5 is equal to 10 minus 5 is equal to 5 plus 1 is equal to 6. Now let us find out the difference in 100's place. Since we borrowed 1 to 10's place, the digit in 100's place is 7 minus 1 is equal to 6. Now 6 minus 6 is equal to 0. Difference between digits in 1000's place is 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. Thus the difference between 4725 and 1659 is 3066. Now let us check and verify. To check we have to add the subtrahend and difference. Look at the example. 1659 is called as subtrahend plus 3066 which is difference. Now add these numbers. We get 4725 which is my new end. Points to remember. Addition and subtraction of numbers can be done easily by arranging the digits in vertical columns according to their place values. Addition gives sum or total. Subtraction gives the difference.